Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a very exciting, exciting video for you guys and I am so pumped to be filming this right now. But right now I'm going to be doing an unboxing and swatch video of the new Jeffree Star Cosmetics Summer Limited Edition Velour Liquid Lipsticks. There was a total of five liquid lipsticks that you could get for the summer collection that he came out with and I got two out of the five. I was considering getting the bundle but I just decided to get two out of the five and I'm going to be unboxing them for you, showing you what they look like and showing you swatches on my hand and on my lips as well. So let's go ahead and get started. I have not even opened this at all. It literally came in the mail last night and oh, I'm so excited. I have just been dying to unbox this since I got them. So we're going to go ahead and just jump right into it. So I have my little scissors here. Um, sorry if the lighting keeps going in and out, can't really control the sun edge here. Oh my gosh, you guys have no freaking idea how pumped I am to be unboxing this right now. I have been waiting and waiting and waiting for him to do these. I am really excited. The thing I'm most excited for is the packaging. You know, if I could just get this open, that would be great. And I don't have my nose piercings in right now because I actually have to go to work in about an hour, so I have those all hidden. Uh, so that's the reason for that. I didn't take them out, I promise. So I'm still trying to get this unboxed, this part here. Here we go. Ready? Oh. Gonna take the receipt out here. So we have the uh, packaging right here, which is really cute. It's just the yellow packaging with the Jeffree Star Cosmetics logo. And then on the inside, I always look forward to the pictures that they send out with each launch because they're always so beautiful and so different. And I kid you not, I still have every single picture that was ever sent with an order of mine. I keep them all in a picture frame and then every time I get a new one, I switch out. Jackal. I switch out for the new one every time. So here's what the back of it looks like where it shows all five of the shades that were released with the summer editions. And then here is what the picture looks like. Absolutely beautiful. We have the Miss Lovely Jeffree Star in the middle and then the two beautiful models on the side here. So I'm really, really excited. This looks like um, Pousset from Orange is the New Black. Like that's the first thing I think of. I love it. So yeah, there's what the picture looks like. Can't wait to put that in my picture frame. It's gonna look so fabuloso, especially for summer. And that's the only thing that came in the box. And then we have the packaging. Okay, guys, let's unwrap this together. Oh my gosh. Okay, here we go. Boom. So here are what the two boxes look like. They are the yellow boxes with the Jeffree Star logo. And a cool thing about these is these are cr cruelty free and vegan. So any these lipsticks are literally for anybody. Really, really like that. I am not 100% cruelty free and I'm definitely not vegan. But I do appreciate when a brand does have vegan and cruelty free makeup products. It just works for everybody and it's just all around better for everything. Um, another thing I want to say before we get into the actual swatching is I don't want to hear anything about the whole Jeffree Star controversy. If I get any comments like that, they will just be deleted because quite frankly, I have my own personal opinions. Other people have their personal opinions. I personally love and support Jeffree Star. I always will. Regardless of everything going on right now, I think it is very unfair to him that he is being picked on so harshly. I think it is just, it's fucking awful. So please just keep your opinions to yourself. If you do not like Jeffree Star, if you do not support Jeffree Star, then do not watch this video and do not bother leaving a comment because I'm just going to very simply delete it and get rid of it because I don't want it on my channel. Moving on, the two out of the five shades I got are Nude Beach and 714. Now 714 he did have out as a limited edition back when his brand was still kind of new and I never did get that one even though I really really wanted it, I never did. So when he announced that he was releasing it again for the summer liquid lipstick editions, I was really, really excited. So I'm just gonna take them both out of the little boxes here and show you. So the first one is 714, just looks like that. And here it is, wow. Like a perfect pink lemonade shade. I love it and I love, love the yellow top. That is absolutely beautiful. Now I think he said this one is the only one who's not, that's not watermelon scent. The next one I was really excited about and this one is Nude Beach. You guys know I absolutely love my nudes. A great majority of my Jeffree Star collection is the nudes. 
and I love those. I will be doing an updated Jeffree Star swatch video on the rest of them, but this video is just dedicated to these two lipsticks right here. So, Nude Beach. Oh, wow. That's really beautiful. He said this is like a macaroni and cheese type color, so we'll see how this one smells. Oh, wow. Yeah, this one is very, very much watermelon scented. Very, very strong. You can smell it, but it's not like disgusting. I really, really like that. So first, I think I'm going to swatch the nude one, and then I will go ahead and swatch 714. Okay, so here is what Nude Beach looks like up close. Really, really beautiful, flattering nude color. I'm really curious to see how it's going to look like on. So first thing is first, I'm just going to give a quick swatch on the hand. All right, so here's what Nude Beach looks like swatched. Hopefully it's in focus and hopefully you can see it okay. Very unique color. Like now that I'm seeing it in person, I don't know how this is going to look on my skin tone. It's gonna be very interesting to see, but I so far really like the swatch. Let's go ahead and give a hand swatch of 714. He said with this one, the formula is a little bit picky because you have to really kind of Vanessa into the lips because it can be a little bit on the streaky side, but that's kind of what you get with these like light nude colors. So I will go ahead and swatch 714. Wow, that is gorgeous absolutely beautiful so this color is very very much out of my comfort zone i usually always go with nudes i don't usually wear pink lipstick if you do see me wearing pink lipstick it's obviously something that i don't do very often now it is time to swatch them on the lips. And then just to help me apply liquid lipstick, I usually always use a lip liner. Now, I do not have anything that matches this exact color, so I'm just gonna be using this lip liner pencil by LA Colors, and this is just in the shade Natural. Now, this is still very, very dark for this lipstick, so I'm just going to apply it very lightly around my lips, just so I have an outline to follow when I do apply the liquid lipstick. So, I'm just gonna start by doing that. Shake it up a little bit again, and we can go ahead and apply it. Okay, guys, so here is what Nude Beach looks like swatched on the lips. As you can very, very much tell, it is a very unique, very different color. I honestly do not know how I like it on my skin tone. I think it looks a little bit, a little bit more on like a crazy color spectrum rather than like a natural nude type of color. And I'm sorry for the crappy swatch job, but yeah, this is what this one looks like. It does make my teeth look a little bit on the yellow side and it is very much a, like he said, a very macaroni and cheese type color. And it looks a lot lighter on my lips than it does on the hand swatch that I did. So yeah, here's the verdict on this one. Here's what this one looks like. What do you guys think of it? I'm not 100% sure how it looks on me. Um, I think this would look really, really nice swatched with like celebrity skin or maybe even like uh, I'm nude or mannequin. I think this would mix really, really well with those colors. So yeah, very interesting color. Like, I don't know. It's like I think I like it, but then again, I'm like, this is really weird. Probably because I've never seen a color like this on my skin before. So like seeing it now, I'm just like, whoa, what? <laughs> like, what is this? This is crazy, but... Again, it's, it's a really cool color. I'm glad I own it. It's limited edition, so once this is gone, it's gone forever, and at least I have one now. So, yeah, this is Nude Beach. The lip liner I'm going to use for this one, uh, the 714, is this one by Rimmel London. And this is the Exaggerate Full Color Lip Liner, and this one is in the shade 101, which is You're All Mine. So I'm just going to line my lips with this and then get to swatching 714. So there is my lips all lined. Now I'm just going to shake up 714. And now let us swatch. I 
actually like this one way more than Nude Beach, which is kind of shocking because I figured I would like the nude one more than the bright pink one, but I think this one looks a little bit more flattering on me. I'm pretty pleased with it. I really do like this color, and I don't obviously own anything like it because pink lipsticks aren't something that I usually go for and something I usually buy. Yeah, here's what this one looks like swatched on the lips. You guys will have to let me know which one you like better out of the two Summer Jeffree Star Cosmetics Liquid Lipsticks. Okay, guys. Guys, that is everything that I have for today's video. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give a huge, huge thumbs up and let me know down in the comments which one was your favorite out of the two swatches that I did today. I would love to know your answer and if you also got these liquid lipsticks, let me know what your favorite one out of the bundle is. I would love to know. Don't forget to go down and subscribe to my channel if you are new here. I would love to have you in my little family that I have growing. That's all I have for today. I love you guys very, very much and as usual, I will see you all very soon in my next video. I love you guys. Bye!